Yo, what's up everybody? It's me, it's Ocarina Link 24 again. Um It's been so long since I did a tutorial and I was looking up my account on um YouTube for some reason or another. I think I was gonna use Haruki and Her somebody was feeling discouraged about their Tao sounding bad. So I was gonna be like, well, you know, it could be worse. It could be Haruka and Haruna. Hashimoto which are a couple of my first ones, and if you haven't heard them sing, I do not recommend that you do it. Just leave it up to your imagination. It's really bad. And, um, so I was gonna send them the link and be all like, yeah, um, yeah, they, they, these, it, it's way better than these, so, you know, your tie is good, don't be discouraged, keep at it. And, uh, instead of typing in their names in YouTube, I typed in Ocarina Link 24. Well, I noticed that I have 164 subscribers, which is crazy. And then I felt bad because I don't post on my YouTube anymore. And, like, I haven't done a tutorial in forever. And anyway, so on DA, recently, I did this tutorial about, um, resetting your envelopes. This isn't a watcher's gift. I feel like it should be something better than this dinky little tutorial on resetting envelopes but um I did it on DA the link to this is in the description if you just want to learn it really quickly or things like that I can learn any way that you teach me I know some people can't so here's an alternate way to do that is to just go to this link I'll put the link in the description anyway so this is a Yumino Suzuki UST it was originally VCV um, I'll do a tutorial on, you know, converting VCVs to CVs later. But, um, this is about resetting envelopes and why it's so freaking important. I ran the plugin to get rid of the audio. But anyway, so, uh, if you don't reset the envelopes, then it doesn't go with your Utah's Oto, which is bad because a lot of times it's really hard to understand. Like, see here, see this overlap? And this, uh, continent? This overlap, which I totally just moved and I did not mean to, um, <laughs> this overlap was a five, 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 and, um, if the person that made the UST, if their overlap is, like, way out here, then that's what the uh that's what the USC is going to think that's where it's going to think the overlap is going to be unless you fix it so i'm going to teach you how to fix it but first here is why it is so freaking important because it'll sound like this if you don't do it i don't know why it's taking so long to load i pre-rendered it like a professional but um yeah, it's really important to do because otherwise it'll just be slurry and sloppy and it'll be impossible to understand. I used a VCV as an example because, I don't know, that's just the easiest way to find one that's crazy. Um, I'm just gonna, you know, cut and paste this out so you don't have to sit here for ever. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Yeah, so, um, love you, Yame-sama, but that was not good. I did delete the vibrato because it was extremely distracting. Um, as you could hear, that was like, what? I'm still recording sound. Yeah, okay, good. Um, that was just like, what was that? That did not sound good. You could not understand a word of it. And, uh, you know, this is Yumino Suzuki. Alex Vocaloid, by the way, thank you. For this UST and the off vocal. To fix this, you go to region property. Okay, region property. You know, that's right click. That would be, oops, that would be a right click and then a region property. Now, up here where it says pre utterance and overlap, hit clear. Do not, I repeat, do not type in zero. Because if you type in zero, and the overlap and the pre is going to be zero. 
and it's not going to be customized to the way you have your Otel Otoed. And um, because of that, it's just going to be, you know, zero, and the Oto is going to be almost for nothing. Almost. Not quite for nothing, but that's another tutorial for another day. Another thing you're going to want to do if you're converting VCV, it's normally not a problem, but you're going to want to go to STP and hit the space bar. Just because that's a VCV thing. It makes the consonants play faster and makes it less slurry. But for CV Utahs, it makes it more slurry. Anyway, so you do that and you hit OK. And then if there are any like exclamation points, you right click, do this one right here, normal, bam, and then you drag and you drop, and you hit space. <laughs> Suzuki, Asumo. I mean, there are obviously some other tuning issues, but generally, that's that's how you do it. You could hear her properly. She wasn't like singing too early. Um, and as you can see, it still has the overlap included in her oto. So that's how you do it. I mean, there's more to converting CV to VCV. That's not what this tutorial is about. Um, this was about resetting envelopes. Um, this is a mistake that a lot of new Tau users use. Do, rather. Oh, these aren't fixed because I didn't have them selected. Um, <laughs> oh yeah, that's another thing. It only applies to what you have selected. It doesn't do all of them. So like, you know, you would select all. I was just doing a short little thing just for the heck of it. Because why do a longer one? Anyway, um, so that's it for now. That's what's important about it. A lot of new Tau users, even older Tau users, don't do this. And it is just so important because otherwise it just sounds weird and sloppy. But anyway, that's how you do it. Uh, thanks everybody. I will see you in the next one. Thanks for subscribing. Really appreciate it, and I am so sorry that I've been inactive. I will try to do better. Okay, bye.